Hello Capricorn, it's Melody from Melody's Wing Terry and I'm here to do your bi-weekly reading for 9, 4 through 9, 18, oh Jesus, 2017. Alright, there's too many flipped up so I'm not going to do that. Nope, if they come out again, they're yours, okay? So, um, I want to thank everybody for like, share, subscribing and setting up personal readings. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below, email me. And we can set something up. All right. I don't know what I said already, but check your sun, moon, and rising signs, and let's get this show on the road. All right. What's going on for the Capricorn? Capricorn, Capricorn. Love reading. Capricorn, love reading. 9 4 through 9 18, 2017. 9 4 through 9 18, 2017. Capricorn, love reading. Right. So, some of you guys are getting out of having nightmares, dreams, bad dreams that's keeping you up at night. Or you may be causing this. Alright, so, um, I'm going to just say it like I do my personal. So, what's going on is, you're getting ready to come out of, you're coming out of some kind of mental distress about somebody using you or sucking you dry emotionally. Okay. Look at this. <clears throat> okay, so it seems like I'm not gonna put this there, but if this was here, it it seemed like they were sucking you dry emotionally, but not um, sexually. Um, uh, with you sexually, we're just gonna go there. All right. All right, so it's telling you that you need to keep going from this situation. So what I'm thinking here is this person might be trying to come back. What is this endurance about? What is this endurance about? Oop. All right, so it's basically saying keep going because you don't really know what's going on with this person. It's like it's saying that like you've been ignoring what this person been saying. You you're so busy. Um, being and feeling drained by what this person is doing or what's going on with this person. Like, just this person being irritating that you not realizing what was going on, you know? It's like, basically, it's telling you to stick in there because uh, you're going to get what they are really trying to talk about. You're going to get what they really was draining them, you know? They're going to tell you what's really draining them. Or you're going to tell them, general reading, it can go both ways. Alright, so, seems like you might have people at your job that are telling you, or like, they think they're trying to protect you from this person, but they're, they're hurting you. They're hurting your relationship. This person is real needy right now, and... You're not being there for them because you got these people holding you back that you work with. Maybe friends or family. Or this could be happening to you also. Okay, so this baggage thing is makes me feel like these people, they've been around for a long time. And they may be a part of your baggage. They're, they're, I just heard it's not the first time that they um stopped you from being with somebody. But it seems like they're pointing out things that... Uh, your ex did that this new person is doing. Out here, it's not that new. So, it's not that new, but they're pointing out things that's going on back there. But I feel like, I don't know, maybe it's some kind of, uh, somebody might need to go to the hospital, some kind of sickness, like, or somebody's, I don't want to say somebody's pregnant, but somebody, something like really wrong with somebody, and it's like you're ignoring it. You think you know what it is, but in a minute, you're going to figure out what it really is, okay? Okay, so... Uh, this makes me feel like you told this person, or this person told you how they... You're being annoying. Like, you, you're getting on my nerves, you know, that kind of stuff. It seems like um, the person who is sick or is something wrong with them... The person who isn't sick has been being mean to them, and it's because of this baggage and these people around them, okay? 
All right, yeah, like I said, whatever this situation is, it's getting ready to come out. You're about to see why this person is acting um, so emotionally draining towards you, okay? All right, what's going on for the Capricorn? Capricorn, Capricorn, okay. So it's like basically, this is like, I don't know. It's like, this is like upright. It's like it's a whole bunch of choices, but it's only one choice you can take from here. So I'm feeling or here and stand by their side or not. Pray that's that's the thing. I don't know. I don't want to say this, but some and some thing it it may be cancer for somebody cuz I keep hearing that, but I don't want to say it. All right, what's going on with the Capricorn? Capricorn love reading 9 4 through 9 18. 9 4 through 9 18 Capricorn love reading 9 4 through 9 18 2017. What's going on? Mm -mm. All right, like I said earlier, I read you straight out the book to ensure you get your full message, okay? Mm-hmm. All right, but just by looking at these cards, it's like here is like somebody just been trying to express to you how they feel and it's like you don't really want to talk about it. That's what I'm getting here. But this, whatever this situation is, this um, plague in their feelings is, is slowly, slowly like um, coming. Like, but it's no stopping it. It's slowly coming. It's no stopping it. And... This makes me feel like this Knight of Swords makes me feel like it might be something that you can't stop. Or it's just nothing, I mean, nothing that you can't stop by yourself, you know. And then you're just going to have a choice to stick there and, and help out or, or not, you know. Alright, so we have the Chariot reversed. And it says, feel you to control yourself physically or mentally. Yeah, that's I guess that's you just like being mad at how um weak this person has been. All right, so we got the Knight of Swords. Knight of Swords, Knight of Swords. Mm, can't find it. Knight of Swords. All right. I'm getting closer. All right, the Knight of Swords is upright. It says people may fight over some issues. The fight may occur quickly that the real issue is lost. Sometimes indicate a young man who may help in the situation. I feel like that's this situation down here where there's people trying to get you to argue and, and fight about things and you really don't even know the real problem, you know? All right, then we have the two of coins. And it's upright. It says, be very careful in any papers you may sign. Make sure you understand any offers that are extended to you so that's basically like whatever this situation is i feel like it's going to be going on for a while i think it's going to be long and i think it's going to be stretched out so it's like if you do choose to be there choose to be there because you want to be there because it's like i don't know i feel like this person really going to need you and just dropping out in the middle of it would be wrong so just make sure this is what you want to do okay so we got the Eight of Cups. And it's upright. It says, it may be time to move on and start new plans. Do not let your pride stop you from making the change. So, wow, this is basically saying, like, what I say here, if you don't think you're ready for it, uh, don't do it. But I don't know what this situation is. Hopefully it's not somebody being sick and, and you wanting to leave them. But if it is... I mean, maybe it's reasons behind that, but that's all I have for you guys. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. If you want a personal reading, check in the description box below. Other than that, have a great week.